Previously on The Walking Dead. Whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really. Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Let Ava live. Shoot her. Wait! I said don't shoot Ava! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go to hell, Joan! <coughs> it's Kate! She's coming for us! Oh, shit! Oh, God! While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to lose. My beer's getting warm. Drink faster. If he plays his last bone... You're out of the wheel, Javier. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game, since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. We'd all understand. Now, don't break your hand patting yourself on the back. I'll beat you next time. Should you even be betting on these games? Isn't that what got you in trouble to begin with? Do we need to have an intervention? Now, keep on talking, David. See what happens. Hey, hey, this is Domino's. Winning means you get to be a little bit of a pendejo. <laughs> Pay up, little brother, if you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Pa, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide. You really should have told us. It's the right thing to do. 
It's my cancer. I get to do whatever I want. You know now. What difference does it make? How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Hey, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. Whatever you want, Pa. I, I won't say a word. Oh, of course, I have to be the one who tells her. Am I the only one here with any sense of responsibility? You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mierda. Great. When do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month. Another game of dominoes to lose. It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money. I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward! A selfish coward! Javi, can you believe this shit? David, I get it, man. It's not fair, but come on, take it easy. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name. For our blood. For our family. Please, fight. You're both the same, only thinking about yourselves. <sighs> Don't worry, Pa. He'll come around. You should have supported him. Wait, what? I'm on your side. Still, I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind. Like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their... bones. Be brothers. Before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man? Okay, Pa. I'll try. As hard as you can? As... As hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oi. If you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're blaming me for all this? I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are.
Something's happened to her. If you've gotten her, you better hope she's alive. Shut up for once and help me find her. What do you think I'm doing? What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Javi. Head in the game, Javi. Get the knee, like this. Nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside! Get in! should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. Hey, Dad. I'm glad you made it out. Joan's probably looking for us. No, she isn't. Javi shot her. What? Good riddance. You were negotiating. I heard you. You didn't have to shoot. Everyone started panicking and shooting. We almost died. You know what Joan's done. Prescott, Mariana, they're gone because of her. I couldn't trust her to keep her word. We'll never know now. Javi's right. Joan had to go. I would have done it too. That's because you don't mind killing people, do you? Those dead guys, they were your friends. Gabe, that's not fair. Hey, you do not walk away from me! When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them. Even if you don't want to. He's scared. Cut him some slack. He's scared because you've coddled him. He has to learn to deal with his problems. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, wanna help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Just be careful, buddy. A lot of muertos out there. Gabe and I will watch each other's backs. I'll help too. O okay. Clem's with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm 
all over the place. I need to focus on something, anything. Just need to focus on whatever. Let's just go upstairs. The further we are from these doors, the happier I'll be. I just want to get as much distance between us and the Muertos as I can. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. We'll get through this. Together. We have for years, right? But what about these people, Javi? They're not as lucky as we are. did this to them. But that hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this as best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible. But I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. You've got a lot of nerve showing up here. After the bullshit you pulled. You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of nerve. Everything that happened is because of you. This is all your fault. I told you, I wanted you out of my life. After what you did to Conrad. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is barely functioning. And before you guys fucked it all up. Their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she, well, fucked us over, but she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying. That counts. Eleanor is one of us. Maybe she forgot it, but I haven't. Thank you, Javi. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Did you see a little girl out there? She was right behind me. I'm sorry. I haven't seen any little girls. First Rufus. <laughs> She knew Rufus. He was her husband. Until you shot him in the back. She's one of my people, Eleanor. What's going on with her? She'll be all right. She's not bitten or anything. She lost her daughter out there. I I'm so sorry. Christ, there's nothing worse than losing a child. Tell me about it. Give her some privacy. It's the least we can do. I want to help you. Okay. Well... What the... We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid easy ass for... showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Shut up! Put it down. You don't want to hurt anyone. Just like you put it down for Joan! Stand down. That's an order. 
Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. I am begging you. I hardly have any family left. Please don't take any more away from me. gonna shoot! Believe me, she was. Because I would have. No! David! Dave! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her! She was going for her gun! Go get her! Dave, I'm... She can't even stand up! What the hell is wrong with you? It was over the line, Gabe. You're right. Gabe, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine then. You people are on your own. Such an asshole. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. David? What are you doing? Come on. Just take a step back. You wouldn't want to, you know, slip or something. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? Even if they are, I'm not. I've dealt with scarier than you, brother. There's no if, Javi. They are. My wife, Javi. My son. They look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. You've said some weird shit before, man. But that's your blue ribbon winner there. I didn't expect you to understand. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. 
Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are. You just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now will you step back? <laughs> sure. Careful, Javi. I ran into... He was still outside when we checked on the entrances. The muertos were everywhere. We got him inside just in time. So we let him in. There were so many muertos out there. Thank God you're okay, man. I, I was worried. Uh, trip. About earlier. Yeah. About that. I ain't gonna punch you in the teeth. Though, I got every right. Really? Figured you'd put up a little bit of a fight. Oh, I'd love nothing more, but... I just... Can't shake this slippery feeling I got. Like I'm... Standing in shoes that don't quite fit. You picked me to die, and... Someone else did instead. Ain't sitting right. Not one bit. I knew she wouldn't shoot you. I knew she was gonna shoot Ava instead. Don't bullshit a bullshitter, partner. I keep putting myself in your position. About Conrad, about all of this. Asking myself over and over again whether I'd do the same. I'd love to tell you I wouldn't. I really would. But I can't. If someone threatened my family, I'd shoot him in a heartbeat. Hell, I'd shoot him twice to make sure the lesson stuck. It's a complicated world. But at least there's people to share it with. Bygones? How about it? I'm in if you are. I'm lucky to know you, Trip. You're a good man. Try not to piss me off again, please. There's so many. They're pouring in. It's even worse than you think. The streets are overrun. Nowhere to go except inside the buildings, and those smelly fuckers are beating down every door. We're sitting goddamn ducks here. Everyone in town is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Huertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. Come on. It's an easy jump. Keep your eyes open and stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. You really want to know? Then ask her. She won't even make eye contact with me. the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns.
We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. David may not be perfect, but he's not the worst role model in the world. Maybe. Be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, here's hoping. Oh, well, thanks buddy. It means a lot. I'm sorry I never really said it before. I should have. Thanks a million. You're welcome, a million. You took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. We're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. Time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Life is full of Fear is the coffee of emotions. It wakes you up, keeps you sharp. It can be a friend if you let it. Once we're back on the ground, that's when this shit's really gonna get scary. Got a bad feeling. Oh, good lord. It's nasty down there. I thought I was toast there. You almost were. If we make it down there, I'll owe you one. When we make it down there, there'll be plenty of opportunities for that. to get across. I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. It's just... One thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? He was afraid. Holding a baby in his arms probably scared him ten times more than any word, though. I don't understand. After you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> Not with that tyrant. 
Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. I miss that, Brett. Never asked Lingard about it again. Though I wanted to. Often. I bet the little brat misses you too. Both of you. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. No one survives by doing what their heart says. They survive by doing what their brain says. If that was his best chance to live, I get it. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. What the hell happened here? No way we're jumping across that. You're not thinking, it's that or go back. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. Same with your jump. Just run off the end, don't leave. David. Try not to... He's got this. She's right. I do. to swing across, but us? So you'd rather stay here? I thought you wanted to fix things. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Okay. Here goes nothing. <sighs> All right, David. You're up. You're the little brother. You should go first. Well, you're definitely lighter. Ah, oh, come on, you know the drill. Age before beauty. <laughs> you fucker. I throw you across.
It's all right, y'all! Shit. We should go back for him! How? Don't be fucking thick! I can... I can handle this! Oh, shit. Trip! Don't give up! Oh, my God. We gotta try. We can't just leave him. Y'all head out now! I don't want you seeing this! Trip! No! None. He went out fighting. I hope I do too. I'm sorry about your friend, Javi. He seemed like a good guy. The kind of guy you want on your side in a fight. It's priceless. Come on. We're almost there. This one, all we did was track the herd. From a safe distance. We need to get down there. We're not getting anywhere without one of those vehicles. It's not like we can just ask all those walkers to move out of the way. How about we make some noise and distract them? We could use that generator. That's a great idea, Gabe. When'd you get so smart, Gabe? You really aren't the same kid I remember. I'm impressed, really. It's pretty obvious. You should have tried noticing. I'm definitely paying attention from now on. Proud of you, Gabe. Uh, thanks. We still gotta get to the generator somehow. Cut a walker open and cover yourself with its guts. Then you can slip right through them. What? Ugh. I please tell me you're kidding. I said please. So, who's gonna do it? Javi, you've been willing to do some crazy stuff for me before. I know shooting Conrad wasn't easy, but it showed me I can always depend on you. Of course, Clem. Look. It smells really bad. Like, way worse than you think.
You did it, Javi. Barely. Now that we're here, we gotta find something to seal the breach with. All we need is the right vehicle. Oh, that's not gonna do the job, man. Yes, it is. What are you doing? The right thing. I'm leaving. We're all leaving. What? And going where? You saw it yourself. We're surrounded by the hurt. I'm taking my family out of here. You helped keep them safe, Clem. You're coming too. Let's go. Everyone. We can't wait around. This is bullshit, David. We can't split up. We're dead if we do. Then we don't split up. We protect each other, like family. This all started the day we knocked on Richmond's door. We brought this on these people, all of us. We can't abandon them. Not after what we've done. We're going home, Kate. Back to the last place we were a family. We're starting over. We're all together again. Finally. It's time. All of us. A new day. A new life. That's crazy talk, David. Home is gone, just like everything else. I thought you guys were gone once, and I was wrong. Maybe you're wrong too. I'll go with you, Dad. Gabe! He's my father, Clem. I'm sorry, but you really wouldn't understand. Think this over, buddy. Gabe, is this what you really want? I know it's scary out there, but... I have to. You don't have to be afraid, Gabe. I won't let what happened to Mariana happen to you. You have my word. I will protect you the right way. We always hoped you would come back. I wish you'd gotten to know her. Her smile, man, it was, it was like sunshine. I'm not missing another minute with my family now. This is what I want. I... I understand, Gabe. I'm still going back. I won't be able to live with myself if I don't try to help the people in Richmond. You won't be able to live at all if you do that. Richmond is compromised. It doesn't matter if there were five of us trying to save it or 500. We'd all die. I know a losing battle when I see one. We're moving out. Everybody get in. That's an order. How fucking dare you? What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Tell him. What the fuck is this? You weren't a good husband to her, David. She deserves better. That's me. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means. David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself? brother. David! Stop it! I love you. No. No, you don't get to say that. Jesus Christ, stop! How fucking dare That's you? That's enough! I love you. No, stop saying that! Taking my family from me. David, no! I'm gonna fucking kill you! I love you, brother. No! Mm-hmm. <laughs>
is he doing? David took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Dave! Dave wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... you're right. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. I'm with you, Javi. We can go after Gabe on that motorcycle or go help Kate on the bulldozer. Wherever you go, I go. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. You have to decide. It's hard to be caught in the middle. I know that. I can't let Kate go by herself. It's too dangerous. I'm going with Kate to save the city. What about you, Clem? Like I said, I'm with you, Javi. Let's go save Richmond. Then we go after Gabe? Then we go after Gabe. If we don't die first. If we're gonna drive into the herd, we're gonna need these. There's a happy sight. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Once I got in contact with my people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. I got your back, Javi.
I'm empty! Here, take over! Let's flood the bridge with the damn truck! surprising that's all i'm just glad you didn't give up on us real glad i gave you my word javi we have to go after gabe these guys can take care of the rest of the walkers go javi i'll help out here okay let's go clem I don't want it. Turn into a muerto. Okay. Okay, I don't know if I can let you do that to yourself. And I can't make you guys do it for me. Just give me the gun. Hurry. Hurry. You. You have to hurry. Father, 
Bobby. But you are a great dad. I love you. I love you too, buddy. I'm glad you helped me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserve better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. This wasn't our fault. This was David. It was all of us. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. We lost a lot. We may have helped fix things, but... There was a cost to it all. There usually is, unfortunately. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be, if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. 
Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away. You're alive. Don't remind me. I'm not gonna say thank you for keeping me alive, but I'm gonna try and find something out there that might make me say thank you. Someday. So where's AJ? Tell me. Where? You know Clem won't rest until she finds AJ. Where is he? Please, man. For her sake. He's at McCarroll Ranch. It's not too far from here. That's... That's where we left him, at least. Thank you. Good luck out there, Doctor. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ, Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? Make your business. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Maybe? So long as he's safe, who cares what he remembers? Yeah. I guess so. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. It's not about good or not good. You kept him alive. You did your job. Until someone else had to do it for me. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? You get back out there, and find something better. There may not be something better out there. You won't know until you step outside. All done. Well, how's it look? You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. <laughs>